All right, so here's how we're gonna do these. Um, all I did was remove all the connectors, uh, removed the plate on the bottom, and basically just uh, unplugged all the plugs off the board, got it out of the way, and now we're just going to install these adjustable joints. So I 3D printed these support plates. They'll go on the inside and these swivel pieces will be on the outside. And this is how they go in. So you're just gonna go in from the inside. Put one in there like so. But you gotta get one of these ready. Put a screw in the middle. Put one, I just used one of the screws that came out of it. Okay. Yeah. And what you're gonna wanna do, put this on the inside. You're gonna line up this with the hole in the middle and get it started. Can be a little tricky. Lighting in here is not good. Got it started. Go in with the drill. Got it snug. Should still be able to adjust them, turn them where you want them. Get them lined up how you want. That looks pretty good on that one. Got that one in there. And then I'm gonna go back with a small bit and just pilot, drill some pilot holes all the way through. You wanna go through, you want your screw to go through that back plate. that take a couple screws get a grip on it here get one in this literally takes five minutes or less for each one of these to install them. No major grinding, cutting, all that mess. I'm using the original holes. Haven't done any prep work to them. Just 3D printed parts. And that one's done. Now I wanna go back and take my screw back out of the middle. Cause I goes to another one that's how quick it is pretty simple